construction of the new Katowice rail bridge has entered a decisive new phase. The pillars are being constructed in the Elbe riverbed. To enable that, the riverbed is being scooped out with visible results. How are more than 700 tons of stone related to the construction site of the new Katwijk Railway Bridge? The answer we show you today. Welcome to Smartport TV. The pillars are being built from top to bottom, and that's a real challenge for both man and machine. You have to bear in mind that the bridge support has an area of 400 square meters and extends 25 meters upwards. So, in effect, we're digging out the equivalent of an 11-story tower block beneath the Elbe. And that digging is facilitated by special technology. The builders are working beneath the Elbe in a special chamber. We have to pressurize it. It's like a diving bell in which you work. The water can't enter because of the pressure, and above the chamber is an access chamber which you have to go down to get there. So everyone working there is a trained diver because they have to be able to work in three bar of pressure so that water doesn't get in. They don't go in diving equipment, they go in normal work clothes. But because the working conditions are like working underwater, they are trained divers. Meter by meter and step by step, they're making progress beneath the Elbe. So how does it work? We basically have two locks. This one here is the material lock. This is how we get the stones up from the bottom, or equipment down to the working chamber. A major challenge is that the bottom of the Elbe is covered in tons of stones. The workers have to shift these stones with their bare hands into the material lock. Hard teamwork. We've had 30 divers working here in six teams and at it around the clock and they've been doing it for two months, so it's a lot of work. So far, more than 700 tons of stones have been shifted from the river bottom up to the surface, and as mentioned, all by hand. It's a very tough job, and we're 20 meters down, going down to 30, and they're working in a pressure of up to 3 bar. Eventually, the supports will go down to 40 meters, a trailblazing project both nationally and internationally. I'm sure it will be the model for many other projects, and it's a very special project for me personally, because I'm sure I won't be part of a project this size again. In terms of the construction, it's really special, in terms of the complexity too and the size, the dimensions of these bridge supports. Once it's complete, the old Katwijk bridge will be used exclusively by road traffic. And that will prevent waiting times of up to seven hours a day. The construction of the new Katwijk railway bridge will continue. And if you like, follow us on Instagram or YouTube. See you next time, and as we say in Hamburg, tschüss!